Hello everyone, Son of Beast here, and welcome back to another NHL on EA Sports. This next matchup, as we are going to take another face-to-face -face look out in this part of the game in the Western Conference section. Tonight's matchup is as being as followed, as the Vegas Golden Knights are playing at Arizona to face against the Coyotes. So only one player allows here in the setup of for the Arizona Coyotes for the starting lineup, and three starting lineup players here for the Golden Knights is Mark Stone, Shea Fedor, and Jack Eichel. Now the two ones over there that we're talking about here for Mark Stone, he has something else to talk about that. It's a yoink. It's an elite defensive stick lifts that he could try to take a yoink out of it and try to use the stick here to make the edge of it to try to pop it out. It might be a great setup for, for Mark Stone if he can get it right away. For Shea Fyodor, he has a heat secret. It's an elite wrist shot that he could try to make that one in, a perfect setup pass, and could be a hard one to try to take them down as they can. So that's the two that we are looking at, of heat seeker and stone. So, sorry about that one, the yoink. And for that one, it's a hard one to try to make a connection out of it, but nothing to worry, it was all that did happen. And as for Clayton Keller, he only had a couple of them, but not really enough to take his own time to go with puck on the string and tape to tape feed. So that is it for the uh, starting lineups this group. Let's send you down to Molot Arena. As we have the next coverage game to stand by, we have now is taking over and under. Paintbrush and the fan. And I will be here along the center of the ice. So... I don't know if I am, but OJ will. So anyway, let's get started, and I hope you enjoy your next matchup. Guys, all yours. This place is about to bring things on, in for a new arena. It's the Mullet Arena, as the Coyotes have our new homes with the Sun Devils. Well, it's about that time, as we're about to get things started. The Vegas wins the faceoff and we're underway. The starting group as follows as Marchlip. Then we have a Smith. Across from every hand we have a Schmaltz. Schmaltz inside. Takes the puck here from the corner. Then it's Hayton. Across from here is Keller. Crunchern and Carlsenberg. Up right here with the starting of the goal. Starting for the matchups. Thompson is a starting for the goalie of the Vegas Golden Knights. Across back from here is Marchisol. Each out with the puck, and it's Smith right down here on the right side. And back over again, each out. Try to take it over with, and stop by the Schmelke. Schmelke is a starting goalie here for the Arizona Coyotes. And right now, back the air away here, here's Marcuselt. Looking in front, and stop by Jamelka. Now, here's what I have to say. This pronouncing is very incorrectly, but I have no other concerns about how this player worked. But it really has to turn things out that how hard it does, it's a very thing to have a compromise to give that one a run. I'm hoping that it might be a player that can be alright, but I'm thinking it might be a tough solution to give this one a credit. Charles takes a seal. Arizona back in the offense zone. Slings the puck. Cranford has the puck here with Curry covered. Send all the way back to Melanka. Malamaki has the puck over to Cross. Taking big out here, defender down. That's hard. The defensive is not really impressed. But that was all it just turned out. Not really the sight well to bring out. Wow, smack her down. Gonfier pass over to Moser. Moves quickly back to Gonfier. And it's Stephenson with the steal. Vegas are in back on the other end. In Arizona territory, makes a shot, he scores! Stevenson has 22 right now. They have the goal up ahead. That play of the puck was very intense. I don't know what to say about that, but it's very that hard to try to keep him up from Stevenson. He had that wrister. Tried to go out of let go, and he didn't notice that he was out there. That was a hard one. Cassell has it in, inside his own, and his pass is broken up. McVeigh flings it, 
Oh, here it comes. The bigger fight's coming on the board. Well, that player's not really interested to try to take the fight. He doesn't have nothing to do with him. And it'll be a tough one to try to take him over. And we have a whistle down. A man is down. That goes to McBrin. McBain was banging on the wall. It was bashful, hurtful. The painful it looks, the brutal it gets. And both players are going to have to help him out as McBain is out. Yeah, I have to agree with that one because a lot of players are making really my credible response. And with that one, it is a hard one to try to keep him up the deck. Not really enough to get right from the saving in between the zones. It's hard, and it's really off the angle. Richie slides it right in front of it in the corner. Sketcher brings the Nemeth. Back to Sketcher. With the shot. Love saved by Thompson, and will hold the puck with only 15.06 to go. Both players are sad they're about to get ready for the puck faceoff. Vegas has 1-0 over Arizona. Booth wins it. Sketcher over to Kassane. Lifts it over to O'Brien. Goes right back to the match. Back to Sketcher. Sketcher with up it. Boy, with the block shot, trying to hold on with the rebound. Nemeth back over to Sketcher. Sketcher around it. Boy, oh boy, this was a tough first defense call. Now here's Smith, scooped up along the board by Cassane. Cassane over to Boyd, look at the one up front! Boyd has it up, finds over to Teicher, back to Stetcher. Stick lifted but O'Brien recovers it. Moving puck back to back to feed for Arizona. Stetcher with it, shoots, shot went wide. That wide one was a very tough one to try to lift it out. That is not going to be a left call because if you don't have that timing right, you're not going to be able to succeed it. Here's Keller. In corner, stuck traffic. We'll have to wait for the man to go off and try it again. Now he's in the corner. Kiss off to Hayton. Back to Chichard. Chichard inside. Glove save by Thompson. That will stop the play with 12-28. Officials are getting set. They're about to take the face off in the offense zone. And with that, Big Cap, Neb wins the face off. Back to Fedor over to Stone. Puck is tipped. Fedor recovers it. Vegas are back in offense to take their own time on their ability run. And Keller comes with the steal. Keller going on fast break. Try to slow it down, the pressure. Goes back to Chai Chern. Goes right to Gossiper. Lost Stemper back over to Chai Chern. Over to Gossiper. With the shot! And Amadio didn't really have that much to need it. Chai Chern. Amino! Locked up! Nice play for Goddess Gear. That play on offense a great solution. It is very hard to deny that one. And better abilities are timing to get things down. Chai Chern with the puck. Inside his own. Gives it over to Buscar. I can't save me by Thompson. And he'll hold the puck in with just only 10 17 to go in the first period. Officials are getting set here on ice. They're about to get the puck dropped for a faceoff. And Dijinskian wins the faceoff. Moser moving in. Stopping the play run with the attack. Going to be a close call. Plays are not that simple. They can't try to keep it over. Scoop the board by Hague. Bergerangelo has the puck. Gives him to Cassell. Trying to make a poke check. But great stop here by Gonfair. Valamaki right back in his own. Trying to hold down the defender, trying to slap the run. Carlson takes the puck, another turnover. Gives over to Cassell. Cassell flings the puck around the net, and it's Velika with the recover. Over to Fisker. 
And here he goes, around the man! I can't stop by Thompson! And I will clear, clear it out with only 8.32 to go. Frozen puck is dropped and we are back to resume the play. Bergandulo right over to Kulsar. Kulsar stuffed the corner up. Stetcher right into back to Fischer. Bayo trying to bling it out. Petrangelo with the puck. Behind the net, now finds Roy. Roy's in the center. Gives it over to Mimef. Arizona back in offense. Trying to bowl it up on him. Mimef outside. Gives it for a killer. Saved by Thompson. Thompson really was going to letter it out. Try to make it square, make it simple. Nemeth outside. Shoots the flame. Too many boys in the way. That's heavy traffic. Try to hold up with the pass. Kosar with the steal. Nice play here on Schmaltz. Fires the puck in around the corner to Keller. Keller shot. Scores! Fires the game! It's Keller! The wrist shot right to the goal post! Oh, that play was a terrific move! And that really has to turn things out that Keller made that one in. Tough one in there. That is a puck on a string for Keller. He was looking at it. Look at the puck, and look at that. That play was right in there. That's how you get the goal right in it. What a play for Keller. And right now, it's Smokes with the assist. They got a tie game with 6.22 to go. Now Coyotes wins the faceoff. Gottesberg with the puck. It's taken over by Fedor. Fedor right over to Echel. Back to Marchessault. Looking over again, and it's Kassane with the puck steal. He fires the puck. O'Brien has one. Gottesfeer right over to Tychern. Tychern back over to Gottesfeer. With the puck. That is hits the chest on Thompson. Still saving it again. That really was deflecting off from the chest. Right from the lower body, it might be hard enough to deny. But could be a trade chaos out of the way. Cross went down. Eichel has the puck here back to Theodore. Vegas back into the offense zone. March for strike. That is hit off the elbow of the pad and it's saved up here by Valica. Battle on the puck along the board. Smith back to March assault. The Knights are looking in. Smith stopped by Ruskoka. I chill with the puck. Smith at it. Stopped again. Cross back to Gonfer. Right to Martins. Martins to Fedor. Shot is ticked wide. That play was not going to be enough to get over it. Because if you're not going offense, it's not a strong ability to try to take it over. The Knights are back in offense zone. Stone with it now. And a penalty is on Arizona. This will be a tripping call here on Gosh's Gear. And yeah, this was happened once. That referee was making a good choice because of that one. That play was turning to be an awful on a bad one. See that play? Because that trip was turning to be a rough one. The Knights are into the offense, ready to take their first power play in the first period. With 3.08 to go. And Fedor has it. In the puck. Valerka take a save here. Aiden will clear the puck down the other end. Now it's Cassell right next to the goalie. Peter over to Stephenson. The Knights are in it now. With the puck, that's Malika with the save. And clang the puck down. 2.30 left to go in the first period. 1.18 left to play in the power play for the Knights. Stone over to Smith. Back to Stephenson. Slings across the stone. In the middle, as Malika save. Two minutes to play in the first period. 
And only 50 seconds on the power play for the Knights. Gives it to Smith. That's Moser with a steal takeaway. Hayton will try to fling it back. Coming down to 90 seconds for first period, 25 for our Knights power play. Here's Stone. Try to take it over. And the play is almost about to be down. They're going to get shorthanded. Oh, big save. And this penalty is going to be going on to the interference. That's Theodore. And right now, this will be a power play coming up for Arizona. Yeah, that has to be that. Because the Theodore was really trying to, like, stop the player in bound. Try to cover him up. If you're going to get stick lifted, then you're going to be out of, your, out of control of it. And you're going to get a penalty. With the win, hey, you. Over to Petrano. Now the power play is on for Coyotes. Over to Richie. Last minute of the play in the first period. Look in front, the middle. And backhand still has it showed up for Thompson. Nemeth back to Stetcher. Look at front by out. Stopped by Thompson with a big save. 37 seconds to go in the first period. What time is just ticking down. Both players are sad they're about to face the tip off. And a win, put it up. McNabb clears the puck down. 30 seconds left for the power play. I mean, for the first period. Bayard has it now. Back to Chicher. Now back to Boyd. 13 seconds left. Trying to look for an offense. Look outside. Chicher in the middle. Richie didn't have the right moment. And beating it. And that will not be in the goal as the time period expires. Still lots of time for the power play for Coyotes, but we'll be back with a second period. Ties the score, 1-1. First period comes to a tie, but now at the second period, it's about to bring things up with only 47 seconds for Arizona power play. And the play continues. Goddess Fear having a look at the ability runs to try to fix the deck. Here's Core! That's blocked up in front. Not really going to move out there. They got to find it our way. Schmaltz with it now. Can the penalty? Oh boy, another one's going to be coming down the man. The player out of reach, and that will be a power play. And a penalty kill is on Riley Smith with the inter-slashing call. With the man gone, he's almost ready to come out. But for Smith, he has to stay in the penalty box. Because of watch here. He slashed it. That was a hard play to make the transition move. Players are ready to take their inbounds. Power play. Five on three, then five on four. Cross up. In the corner, not a good look here. And now the man advantage is over. They're back into one man advantage. Hawk is fired out. Cross holds it on. Back to Bayard. And a chow. Try to take the puck away from him. Arizona has it back in offense control. Back in offense zone in the Knights territory. Look to Richie. Richie shot right around the bottom of the of the elbow and it saved me. Richie rolls back over to Kraus. He goes right back to Chai Turn over to Gottesfair. Gottesfair almost took the puck away, but that shell has it. 33 seconds for the Arizona power play. Here's Kraus. Has now with the puck. Stick on the move. Backhand is not enough. Back to Garspear. He's almost ready to go. McNabb has it. Flings the puck. And the power play is over for Arizona as the players are definitely back in even strength. They're very good plays with that one here. What a great play for Arizona. But for Vegas to the Knights, they have a trouble one to take over the advantage out there. They have to find another way to try to stop their run. And that will be a hard look on impact. Mark Stone with a yoink 
He goes right into this player. He goes right here in the offensive zone here and wants to take a puck recover with the stick lift. He can try to take a defense in and try to lift it over to turn it things off. I'll keep in touch with Mark Stone in the game. Back to you guys. Hayton back over to Keller. Moves back to Moser. Back to Velamika. Alamaki back to Moser. And a pass broken up. Prochangelo with the puck in and the neutral zone. He goes across to Stone. Stone with it now. Bodies and out of the control. Get out of the way. Smaltz has it. Trying to move around it. Smaltz finds Moser. And he didn't have the right moment to try to hold the puck. And it's Thompson coming up with the glove save to stop the play. Both players are set here for the faceoff. The tie score has been released here in between Coyotes and the Knights. Now here's Kessler. Kessler in the middle. Blocked up out of here. Malamaki with the puck's takeaway. Kumpier in the puck in control in the corner. Looks to curse. Shot. Saved by Thompson. Back to Theodore. Back to McNabb. Nice zone entry for McNabb. No pickup plays to take over. Looking front. Ah, there's that cut with the save. Nemeth has it now. Back to Kraus. Body down with the smack. That smackdown turned to be a very tough one to take ability out of it. Like football players. Carlson back over to Theodore. 13.42 to go in the second period. Feeder find Carlson. Carlson moving inside in a neutral zone to Cotter. Puck taken away by Stetcher. Coyotes in fast break. 2-1. No chance. Look here. O'Brien didn't have the good timing right. He's out of the range. That play was too much of it. Because of how he did, it's very hard for O'Brien to stay on track. It's too hard. Not going to be enough to try to keep him out of the range to go with a different look. Pichel has the puck here in the middle. Pichel! Great stop by Chichern. With the offense rebound, here's Keller. Stopped by Thompson, and that will be a slashing call. No, holding call. That will be on Braden Preshko. Yeah, here we go again. A lot of players are in the power play for Arizona. And a lot of penalty kills here for Vegas. That's going to be a tough range out of sight. With tough team plays, it's still one, one game. Power play is up for Arizona. Schmaltz with the, with the win. Now here's Scheitzer to kill her. Finds Goldsmith here. Ah, the puck take away by Smith. Regroups the man on offense. He finds over Keller. Now they're back in Vegas territory. Move around to Hayton. And here we go again, another penalty. This will be a three on five for the power play advantage. Go to Spear! And it stopped the play and whistle. Two players are in the penalty box with the slash. Riley Smith in the penalty box. Oh boy, it looks like the Vegas Knights are having a trouble look out there. He's complained about that he was trying to take him over with the puck to take away from it. But the player doesn't bounce. He was going to try to lift it out. And that is too hard to, then, to try to keep it over because the man on the offense was taking it over, trying to move around quick. And right now the play is back inbound. March stands and Moser has it back. And offside is whistled. They will have to be playing in a neutral zone to get ready for the faceoff coming up. And Puck wins it. Martinez lifts it up. He gives over to Bayard. 
Looks over to Kraus. Two on one. With the shot. Looped it out. And it's up into the netting. What a stop by Thompson. That Thompson was going to be lifting it over. He was almost going to miss that. But he had to hit with the glove. That's a great play. Rebound makes a win. Hey. Puck carries out. 24 seconds for five on three. Deep pass to Kraus. Kraus with it now. With the shot. Stopped by Thompson. Gives it up. Nothing in front. Past the mid period in the second. Still a tie game. Both players are set. Ready to take the face up. A score is still even. Five seconds for, our, for a man advantage of five on three. And it'll be five on four for the power play. One player is out. And now the power play is up. Cross with the puck. Goes back to Moser. Back to Gonfair. Back to Moser. Waits for it. He goes in. Star is tipped out of the way. Guys over Cross. Gonfair. Over to Moser. And to Pascal. Gotta be sure handed. With a shot. Save by Malika. Oh wow, that is a play thing to go right in a heavy moment. That really has to get things up here right away. Penalty up, and here he comes again. The Knights are in trouble. The slash is on Martinez. Now yeah, that was going to be a hard one because the Martinez was really going to be a hard look. And nothing is going to kill you right at this momentum. Yeah, that play, that was easy. Another power play. They are trying to get a goal here in the second period to try to break the score up. And McNabb has it. Puck carries out over the end. Goes over to Smuts. The Coyotes are in offense zone. Oh, here he goes. Waits for it. Finds color. And it's passed up, broken up here as Petrano. Petrangelo. Flips it out of here. Now goes back to Keller. Gonna be Mad Man Rush. Look it in! Score! It's a power play goal for Keller! They tie it. It's broken. And now they're in the lead. I love that hustle look of Cody Keller. When that play is broken, that fast man of Odd Man Rush was the liberation like he never died. And that was a great play. I love that one. That Keller was able to take two of his goal of performance. He is saying, I'm coming for you, and he had that right on the board. And thanks to Gosfear, he's got the assist here for tonight. I will be keeping an eye on one of the players if he have gotten a release to take it over once more. Back to you guys. Gosfear battling for the loose puck. And it's Vamika. And he'll have to hold the puck outside. Now back inside, Valmeka. He fires it to Hayton. Trying to pull it back. Hayton out of here. Schmaltz trying to escape. Valmeka to Mauser. He gets back to Schmaltz. Great play for Arizona Pass. Puck is taken away by Stone. One on one. Shot tipped wide. Adamito had it out. Scooped up along the board by Hague. Petrangelo to Stone. Vegas are back in offense on Coyote. Stone with it. Lost the puck but holds it for Melamica. He flyers the puck. Justad. Justad to Krauss. Back to Moser. To Krauss. Back to Melamica. Valamika back to Kraus. Shoots! Stopped by Thompson. Now back to play here is Marchessault. Marchessault in the corner. Puck is tipped away. Finds Gunfear. Gunfear smacked down in the corner near the blue line. That was going to be a tough whistle play. Nobody is going to try to lift it over it. And I'm going to have to tell you this one here because the player was trying to make a scrap. 
to hit them out of here, that would be a tough one to try to fix it from the facts of it above. Fired with the puck. He fires the puck. Went down hard. Oh boy. Here it goes again. This one's a very tough one to try to keep it out of here. The meth back to Stetcher. Back to the meth. A lot of play back to back feeds. Fisher. And stopped by Hague. Back to HL. Now back to Marcusel. Puck carried away. Richie. With the shot. Saved by Thompson. Now we'll stop the play inbound for just 321 to go in the second period. A lot of heavy hits on this one. But right now the Coyotes are in the lead. Just a 2-1 score. Fido with it. Now to Cassell. Cassell with it now. Then Meth take his puck steal. He clears the puck out. Icing is whistled and we got a face-off ready for action coming up. But there are players of Shane Fyodor. He makes a heat seeker here to try to go right around the man. When he finds the right moment, he takes his wrist shot. With that play, it's hard to find another way to get a wrist shot in the net. I'll keep an eyes on Fyodor right around the goalie and see how he does. Back to you guys. Stetcher falls back over to Mimeth. Back to Stetcher. Uh, battling along the board is Kevin out. Regroup the puck is fired. And it's Cutter with the steal. Trying to lift it back. Schwaltz to Keller. Out of reach. Back to Stetcher. Back to Keller. Now it gives over to Hayton. There are a lot of passing moments for the Coyotes. And Connor takes a steal. Connor along the board. Around the net. Last minute to play in the first, second period of the game. That is going to be blocked out. Right over to Keller. He takes it in along the middle. Gives up to Smaltz. Shoots him on and it's blocked by Hayton. Didn't Wilson seem to be ready enough to get over it? He has to get up. Offside is whistled at only 18.4 seconds. Now the players are set here, ready for the faceoff. 2 1 is where we left off. Pachard wins the faceoff. Chaitur in the corner now. Gives it to Gonfer. Five seconds left. Stephenson. Trying to deliver with the shot. Stop by Velika before time period expires. And now the second period is over. What a great play out there. Thanks to Cody Zeller making a tiebreaker run to Leah. Third period underway when we come back. 2 1 is a score. It has been a tremendous night. And with 2-1 score, the third period is about to begin. Here we have played here just a lot of heavy matches in the Western Conference side, but it was very tough to hear that they have a lot of plays back-to-back -back switches. I know it's true, but to tell that one here, that Smokes and the other players are just trying to keep their eyes on a string. The players are all inbound, trying to keep them out of the range. They really got a lot of things to tell. God of Spear with the puck. Goes back to Hayton, with the shot, it's stopped by Thompson, gives it back, and a penalty is on Arizona. Now it's going to be a switchback. They could be going for a tying game and a run, because of this one, they have no other options to get right around it. That will be a hard one to try to tell the story of it. Stone has it now. Gives it to Pachanjo. March itself has it. He goes right to the middle. Hatchell up! Oh my goodness! But not this time! Hatchell, the puck went over the goalie and it went back in. They did not need a power play. I gotta look at the replay again. It looks like the puck went over the goalie and it went right behind the leg. That seemed to be out of here. It was hard enough to try to find out that Hatchell has it. 
And because of that play was really inbound, he could try to like take him over it and try to trick the goalie. That was a tough play. Cross back to try turn. Back to Gardasphere. Gonfier with the puck. Moving out with a smackdown. Cross with the puck. Stopped by Thompson. Try turn back to Bastad. Gardasphere. Puck was out of reach and this will have to regroup for the offense. But just stand right in the corner of the wall. Flings up on the board. Thank you with the takeover. Smith with it now. In the attacking zone. Look around the middle. Oh, what a save by Malika. He's just, just going big, bang, and down. That really hard play was turning to be a top line. Great stop. Balamaki over to Moser. Moser stopping the play to whistle him out. Amida over to Stone. Stone in the middle. Shoots! Scores! Back in the lead for Stone! He has 10! And they are up on the board to try to face back. Then the play comes down to one. Mark Stone reaches out with Pierre with his 10th goal. The Vegas are back in the lead. And a winning comes up to Pachanjo. Stone back to Stephenson. Stop by Malika. Oh, Emilio. Oh, that'll be out of trouble. If they put it in there, they would get a goal. Arizona back in offense zone. And a bad pass here, but it will be Nemeth. Gets back to Stetcher. Back to Fischer. To Bio. In the attack is Arizona. Coyotes looking for offense zone to take the score and tie the game. Nemeth has it. Back to Stetcher. Stetcher back to Nemeth. Back to Richie. Richie and Amadio with us take away. The players are very good here on defense because this is not where we are going at. Because players are offense of the struggle, they have it all. Stone, stop by Rileka. Algie make a killer. Puck clears out. Battle along the puck. Schmaltz recovers it. Outside still. Nemeth with a slab shot. That tipped wide and it's out of range. Smelts with the puck. Scoop back over to Stetcher to Mimet. Back to Stetcher. 12.40 to go in that third period and it's stopped by Thompson. Bertangelo right back to Kessler. Moves quickly over to Hague. Regroup the puck is Pierangelo. Back to Kessel. Back to Carlson. In attacker, saved up again. And back again. Stopping the puck. My goodness, and Maliko made that save. That puck was like inbound. Why the plays in inbounding, rebounding the puck? It's hard to sell. It's going to be a very tough one to try to keep him out of here. 11.20 left to play in the third period. Now back to Smaltz. Smaltz back over now to Keller. Shoots one and stopped. Glove saved by Keller. Well, 11 04 left to Glove go here in the third. It's 3 2 lead. Officials are getting set here. They're about to get the puck face off ready. And a win for McNabb. The Knights are back in offense neutral zone. Coming for Vegas. That will be a double range. And number back call. It's going to be a back to back switch. And not a power play goal to take it over with. That's going to be very hard to try to keep it out. Chai Chern recoups the puck outside. Back to Smoltz. Smoltz moving now. Back to Scottisphere. Shoots. Stopped and blocked by Fedor. And now will be a penalty upcoming with a slash. That's how it marked itself. Monty Silva was really in depressed. Very hard look to take it over. 
That will be a hard one to take out. And that is a very tough one to make a slash. Not a good wild side. Power play is up here for the second time as they're going to take a look here to try to tie the game up if they can do it. Past the midway period. And Carlson. Pascal with it now. Fedor lifts the puck, clears the deck. Backing over again. Here's Kraus. Kraus in the corner. Gonna tie it! No! It's the block day out. Try to turn back over again. Try to hold the puck. Goddard what a great save. Try to turn with the puck. Try to take it away. Smith with it now. Just a minute to play for the power play for Coyotes. Kraus has it now. Move around the man. He back past the Godfair. Godfair shot. Not ready to take enough venture. They're going to need to find another way to open it. Open the deck. This really has to go with another luck. 30 seconds for the power play for Arizona. Gives over to Kraus. Lifts it over to Richie. 13 seconds to go. Time is almost ready. He's about to get going out there from Arkansas. Pascal lifts the puck, and the penalty kill is out. Power play is over for Arizona. That play was whistled and bound. There's a lot of great moments to take the offense and take around it. And but because the players are just going right in there, they're not going to be enough to take the successful range to lift it out. Moser with the corner. Back to Keller. Makes a shot. He scores! He ties the game! The outs are coming. It's a hat trick shot. Look at that, the fans are going hats everywhere. All eyes on Keller. He had a hat trick shot, and Keller just made that one in there. What a play. Yep, with that one, it looks like the killer was able to try to go with the back-to-back -back switch. Says, no worries, I got that. And he has his third goal for tonight. Three in a row right now. A hat trick save, and what a play. Here's Stephenson. That stopped again. Stone. Over out. I like a save. Battle on the board. Now recovers to O'Brien. Brian smacked down. Boyd with it now. He back past the Valamecki. Oh, almost would have tipped it over, but Kassan holds it. Stephenson takes a steal. Stone with the puck in the corner. In the attacking zone, Amario! And it's off again, Amelika. Hawk along the back. Play whistle, play whistle, not able to take the icing as the play continues. What a play here. Oh boy! Oh, that will be tough now. Thompson with the save with 5.28 to go. In the third period, it's going to be a tough one to carry. Now officials are ready to get set here. They're about to get the face off. Right now, Petrangelo with the putt. Gives it over to Stone. Stone with it now. Stone recovers, back to Amadio. In the middle, Stephenson, and that's kicked off here with the knee pad save. Stephenson, that is another save look. Hey, you with the puck. That takes it over and now goes back the other way. Try to clear it out with the clear puck, but Hey, you holds it. Back behind on the board. Goddesfear has the puck steal. Over to Kraus. Back to Bustad. Bustad with it now. Bustad trying to hold it through. Got a spear. Up again. Look around him in. Try to look open here. Back to Chai Chen. Over to Gumpier. And Roy with the steal. Chai Chen holds on. Roy with it now. Back to Carrier. We're down to 320 left to play in the third. It's still a tie game. That is a good sad save here. Schmaltz fires the puck in corner. Back to Pajangelo. Back to Kolsar. Kolsar in the corner right now for Vegas. 
Molly with it now. Glove save by Olenka. And now I'll stop the play here with just under three minutes. Both players are set right now. They're about to take the face off. Timeout will be released. And with the play here of Cody Zeller, he is able to make that one a great succeed into this game. Gives a pass and looks over front in the middle. And I'll salute to the captain assistant for receiving hats. And he made that one a great stop. The play is just a hard one. It's just going right by it. Because defenders are up there to make that play a solution in between by Zeller. Finds room, hits the goalpost on the crossbar, and went right in it into the net. They all tied it as they brought hats here right over Thompson. The play is resumed right now, as we know that Keller has made that one three goals of this game. However, it didn't really happen to be approving much here how well he had done. The play really that simple can be a lot that hard, but just a great work beyond that credits. We also look to here to Keller, the assistant captain, receiving the hats. Right now it's Theodore, he makes the goal! They have the lead in front! And we are here all night. The Knights are back in front. It's secret revenge out there. There is something else to talk about that Peter was making a wrist shot. All he has to do is just make his way down on the board. And say this one here, guys. They have a, just a crazy plays in this game. Not really the same thing that everybody really wants. And give that one a good friendly competitions out there. Let's see if one of the players gets a good ones in the top three stars of the game. I'll keep an eye on Fedor at the end of the game. Back to you guys. The man advantage. Ready to take on here for the Coyotes. With the shot. And stopped again by Thompson. Moser has it out front. 50 seconds left. Looking for Moser. Inside alone, shoots, and they are going to pull the goalie. Man advantage is on. Battle in between. Hayes in with the puck. He scores. Oh, my goodness. This is the back-to-back -back score. And they are still believing it. The man advantage, they have it all down. What a shot by Hayton. You can tell that Hayton was making that wrist. He was able to make that one in there. And I'm telling you this why? Because he made that in. Both teams are tied with just 37.9 seconds in the third period. Might be able to hold on and get ready for overtime. We might be seeing the next one coming by. Yeah, I hope so because there is a lot of choices. Hopefully another overtime can go right in the game. 20 seconds left. Goshmere just waiting for the clock to roll down. Fisker went offside and that will carry the puck in the neutral zone. Players are set here in the faceoff. Only 15.3 seconds tie game. Knights win it. 12 seconds left. Smith lost the puck and Goshmere has it. A churn going to Risky looking for a win. With the back in, and stop by again. Richie, he scores! Beats the buzz beater. Richie puts it back, and this all comes down to everyone. Salute, Knights. Richie, my gosh. That play of this one just go around the back. They're saying no overtime, he just wants to beat it. Wow. Amazing by Peter here in the third, and that, my friend, was an epic win. Arizona Coyotes beat the Vegas Knights with a tough score by four. Wow, that was epic. Well, this has been a great night, and I'll tell you, we all salute fans here in Mullet Arena. Better than the Down River or Nile Arena. It's just the top ones that you can go out here in the Pacific Coast of the team. 
by Arizona and Nevada on Las Vegas. While well, that's being said, me, Paintbrush, along with Fan and OJ, this has been your presentation of the NHL and EA Sports. Good night, everyone, and now let's go right to Summit Beast to close the game. All you for you. All right, Paintbrush, thank you very much. Let's have your look at the three star players of the game. The third star goes to Nick Ritchie. A goal with a buzz beater with around the back. Try to blind to Thompson on the goalie, and he finally nailed it. The second star goes to Barrett Hayton with a goal and assist. Really well done out there. Just going back to back in between the tie the game in the third. And your first star, that goes to Clayton Keller. Three goals with a hat trick. We all salute the assistant captain. That is an epic goal finish. So here are the total shot combinations, how they did. 36 for Arizona and 30 for Vegas. 16 hits was a bum out to take them down. And three only exist for Coyotes. And time on attack was only 14.58, almost 15 minutes here. And 4.11 for Vegas. There are some a little high and low number range here for the passing aggressive. 93 percentage for passing for the Vegas and 82 percentage for Arizona. 25 faceoff wins for Vegas and 13 for Arizona. Penalty minutes was on 12 minutes for Vegas and 2 for Arizona. Only a power play goal made for Arizona and nothing for Vegas. And the power play minutes was only 925 remaining. A lot of plays in this call was turning out dirty to be cheating and just not really enough to get enough uh, a bunch of uh, players that are wanting to take their own time and try to knock it out. But it's not very helpful enough to try to keep them around by in between. Yep, you can see the caps are flying. That's three for Zeller. Well done. Well done for him. So anyway, that should do here for the second to last game. The last game that we will be seeing is the Flames and the Krakens at Climate Pledge Arena. The next commentary for the last one of this matchup, I will have me phone in the center of the ice and on the outside of it I will have his test tube and of course me yeah definitely true me because I know that it's a very tough one to try to think of it ahead and with that one I hope you all enjoyed and hockey is winding down almost a bit but not to worry once this regular game is over then we will be heading to the NHL Stanley Cup playoffs for the second time of the season. So we'll see how this one turns out when we get close. Thank you for watching. Peace out everyone for a while as the NHL on the A Sports style. This is Son of Beast. Make sure to subscribe to my channel. If you don't, somebody will. And yes, that's the play that you're looking at. The puck over the goalie and it went right behind him. That was a tough one that you're looking at right on the screen. Anyway, that is it. See you next time. Bye. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.